Welcome back to the Coach's Hangout. In today's video, I'm gonna give you a tip that's gonna make calculating approximate yield to maturity, also known by the acronym YTM, a snap. But first, are you finding these videos helpful? Well, please let us know so we can keep the content coming. Subscribe to our channel, like this video, and leave us your feedback in the comments section. We love hearing from our viewers. All right, after that shameless plug, back to YTM. Let's take a look at an exam preparation question that I've greatly exaggerated for learning purposes. You'll also see the YTM formula on the screen, taken from the CY Learning Study Guide. As you can see, we have simplified the wording a bit as opposed to what you'd find in a traditional textbook. Now, ABC Bond is trading in the marketplace at 90 and has a 4% coupon rate and matures in five years. Elon is purchasing a heck of a lot. I'm not even sure what that number is. A billion something? Face value of the bond. What is the bond's YTM? What if I told you with practice, you could do this question in 30 seconds or less? A well-trained eye can almost visualize it as simple as $6 divided by $95. But before we get too far into the math, what do you notice about the available answer choices? They're all percentages, and that is key. What that tells me is that Elon owns more than a billion dollars face value of the bond and I only own a hundred dollar face value, we will both receive different dollar amounts of interest, but our yield as a percentage would be identical. After all, it's the same bond. What a headache it would be trying to figure out what the 4% coupon payment would be on Elon's huge bond. It makes my head hurt just thinking about the math. So let's cross that out and pretend that Elon is only buying a $100 face value of the bond. It's so much easier. Now we don't have to modify the market price of 90 because that already refers to $100 face value of the bond. This is simply how bonds are priced and you need to know that. This is really no different than if I told you gas costs a buck 20 in Toronto. You would know that is per liter. Likewise, if a bond is trading at 90, you need to know that is per $100 face value. And if this point confuses you at all, stick around to the end of this coach's hangout where I'll refer you to another video where we cover the concept in detail. All right, let's fill out the formula, starting with the top. If Elon has $100 face value of the bond and it pays a 4% annual coupon, that would be $4 per year. If the bond is trading at 90, and will mature at 100, which is the face value amount that the issuer borrowed, that represents a gain of $10. So we put a plus sign. The total gain over the life of the bond is $10. So we divide that number by the five years remaining until maturity and get an annual gain of $2. To recap, on the top of the formula, we have $4 plus $2 for a total of $6. Next, let's fill out the bottom of the formula. Today's price of $90 plus the maturity price of $100 divided by two equals $95. This is so easy, I can almost do the math in my head, but I won't. Always use a calculator. You don't wanna make silly mistakes. Finally, we divide $6 by $95 and get a YTM of approximately 6.32%. And I promise you, if you do the same calculation with a much larger bond, even a billion dollar face value bond like Elon's, your yield as a percentage will be the same. If you found this tip helpful, be sure to check out one of our older YouTube videos we posted back in 2018 called Yield to Maturity. The video itself may not be as slick as this one. We keep upping our game each year, but it's still a very effective lesson. In this video, we make you a pro by throwing everything at you but the kitchen sink. We calculate the YTM on a bond that is trading at a discount like the one we just did, one that is trading at a premium, one that is extendable, one that is retractable, and even one that is trading at par. After watching the video, you'll be prepared for whatever comes your way on exam day, so be sure to check it out. We'll put a link in the description below. Thanks for stopping by the Coach's Hangout and good luck on your upcoming exams.